This is a typical scene in many areas of Thailand that are flooded. Here in Patum Thani, almost the entire province remains underwater. And in many cases, the only dry areas around are these elevated roads. And they have become virtual parking lots where people are leaving their vehicles. They've been here for a very long time now in the hope that their vehicles stay out of harm's way. And where the dry road meets the floodwaters has become a slice of life in a disaster zone. The simple task of trying to get somewhere is made difficult by inundated roads. After two months battling the floodwaters, some vehicles give up. Repairs have to be done on the side of the road. The power steering is broken. We're trying to fix it. Going into the water in many areas is now the domain of large trucks only. More often than not, their cargo is people trying to get to and from their homes. I'm going back home to the canal. We can't go on the motorbike because of the flood. But I need to get home to look after my house, which is also flooded. When the car won't make it, a boat is sometimes the only option. The end of the road has also become an important area for people to collect supplies. The water may be receding in some places, but in others, the disaster is just beginning. People have adapted to their watery existence, but everyone wants it to go away. Wayne Hay, Al Jazeera, Patumtani, Thailand.